Hi everyone, Kevin here. Today, I wanna show you how you can set up Microsoft Outlook so you'll never miss an important email from your boss. First, I'll show you how you can do it on desktop and then we'll look at how we can do it on mobile. All right, let's check this out. Here I am in my Outlook desktop inbox and right up at the top, I have an email from my boss, Patty Fernandez. It looks like she wants to know if I wanna work the night shift at the Kevin Cookie Company. And of course I don't wanna work the night shift. That's the worst possible shift, but I'll probably still end up saying okay. The first way to make this message stand out a little bit more is to use something called conditional formatting. And that way I'll notice this compared to all of the other messages. To use conditional formatting up on the top tabs, click on the one that says view. Over on the far left-hand side, click on View Settings. Within View Settings, let's click on Conditional Formatting and in the top right-hand corner, click on Add. We're gonna add a new rule called Patty Fernandez, the name of my boss. Next, let's click on Font and here we can define what messages should look like when they come from your boss. Over here, let's select a bold font style. I'll also go with bigger, and right down here, I'll select a color that'll really stand out. I'm gonna pick red. Next, I'll click on OK. Next, I need to define a condition. Basically, what messages in my inbox should get this treatment? Over here, I could search for specific words in an email, or if it comes from a specific individual. In this case, I only want messages from Patty Fernandez. Up here, I have even more choices, and under advanced, I have even more choices, but I just wanna keep it simple. I only want messages from Patty Fernandez, so I'll click on OK. Back here, I'll click on OK, and then I'll click on OK once again. All right, that's pretty nice bright red text. There's no way I'm gonna miss that, assuming I'm in my inbox. But what if I have Outlook minimized? What do I do then? To make sure I don't miss a message when Outlook is minimized, I can have Outlook play a sound and I can also have it show a new item alert window. To set this up, select the message. Here I'll select the message from Patty Fernandez and up on the top ribbon, let's click on rules and then go down to create rule. This opens up the create rule dialog and I want this to apply to all messages from my boss, Patty Fernandez. So here I'll check this box. When I receive a message from Patty, I want Outlook to do the following. First off, I want to display a new item alert window. And in a moment, I'll show you what that looks like. And right here to make sure I don't miss this, I'm also going to have Outlook play a selected sound. Here, you can browse your PC for a sound. I've already selected this one. Let's give it a listen. That sound does a pretty good job of describing my emotions when I receive an email from Patty. Next, let's click on OK. Next, it shows us this prompt that the rule has been successfully created. Now, this rule will only run when you have Outlook open. So to see the new item alert window and to hear the sound, once again, Outlook has to be open. That all sounds good, so let's click on OK. And look at that, I need you to work on Saturday. Yet another unreasonable request from my boss, Patty. Okay, that's pretty good. I guess if I'm on my desktop, I'm not gonna miss an important email from my boss. But what if I'm on the go? What do I do then? To make sure you never miss a message from your boss on your phone, I recommend getting the Outlook app. You can install it on both iOS and on Android. Within the Outlook app, click on a message from your boss. Here I'll click on a message from Patty. With the message open, click on your boss's picture and this will bring up her people card. In the top right hand corner, click on the star. This will make her a favorite person. And just because it's favorite, it doesn't mean they're really your favorite person, but this way notifications from Patty will just stand above all the rest. Now that we've added her as a favorite, let's click on the back icon, click on the back icon again, and then let's click on your profile picture in the top left-hand corner. This opens up the backstage, and at the very bottom, let's click on the settings gear. Within settings, go down and then select notifications. Within notifications, you can set it up so you're alerted to messages from your favorite people only. This way, messages from your boss will stand out compared to all other people. 
I'll make sure to select this one. And here is another urgent request from Patty Fernandez, and now it pops up on my phone. They really don't pay me enough money for everything they ask me to do here at the Kevin Cookie Company. All right, well that's how you'll never miss an important email from your boss. And it sounds like, unfortunately for me, I'm going to have to work the night shift. So maybe instead of using these techniques, I'll just claim that I never saw the email. To see more videos like this, please consider subscribing and I'll see you next time.